Hello everyone, welcome to my science channel. Today we will talk with you about the important data bank called Example. What information can we access and what opportunities it provides us? Let's examine it together. Ensemble was uh, first developed in 1999 prior to the publication of the first draft of the human genome and the aim of the Ensemble at that time uh, was to annotate the human genome uh, with gene models and other uh, available data and uh, to make it all available throughout the web. And since uh, then Ensemble has continued to provide a genome annotation and for more and more correlate species, including human, mouse, and zebrafish, uh, you can see that. And the range of the species annotated uh, in Ensemble covers uh, broadest taxonomic species possible, uh, including conversational and agriculturally, uh, medically, and eventually important species. Ensemble also presents a gene annotation for a small number of the vertebral chordate species such as a lamprey and sea squirt, as well as non-chordate species such as the fruit fly, sea elegans and saccharomyces. Which are the species that are important model organisms and are used in our comparative uh, analysis? And while Ensemble um, is focused on chordate species, Ensemble Genome is a sister project that extends Ensemble across the taxonomic spaces and is dedicated to non-chordates, namely bacteria, uh, fungi, uh, protists, and non-vertebral mesotoles, and other plants, for example. And here you can uh, find uh, this the Ensemble Genome Project also, and maybe I can see you. You can see that uh, all details and other information very useful website. On the other hand, in, for each species, uh, Ensemble uh, annotates a right range of data onto the genome assembled. The, the first of the, this type of data is the gene models. Uh, for the protection of gene models, um, called the gene bolt sequencing from International Nucleotide Sequencing Database or INCDCS and you can know that uh, early uh, videos in CBILFSEC and in report are allegiant to the genome. This is a called uh, automated gene annotation pipeline for human uh, mouse uh, right pig and uh, zebrafish uh, again you can see that and uh, ensemble also incorporates manually uh, created a transcription from the Havana project and the merged set of the genes uh, from the automated and manual annotation is called the gene code gene set. Then, in addition to the gene annotation, a variety of other data types are further annotated onto the genome uh, were available uh, including variation data, comparative genomics analysis and the annotation, the regulatory features. Uh, let's see how all of information is arranged on the Ensemble uh, browser uh, website. You can see that e easily and you can receive uh, easily. And uh, this is the Ensemble uh, web page. Uh, I agree this site. The blue bar uh, at the top of the is present on every page of the ensemble and, and contains links to number of the different tools including uh, blasts. Uh, you remember uh, this 
method blast uh, very important uh, for uh, crew PCR biomark and the variant effect predictor as well as other features including uh, help and documentation this is also a research bar at the top of the home page and that's allow you to research all of the species in assemble for genome coordinators engine names uh, probe sets variation and phenotypes or regulatory features uh, information uh, etc and the other hand uh, every two and three months the browser uh, underlying databases are updated which is all including a single rise version you can see all other Feature species, especially human, mouse, and uh, zebra fish. And the news in the top of the right uh, to the home page shows the current uh, release um, variation and announcements uh, of the incorporation of new data as well as updates and changes in the annotation. And uh, achieve links is the present uh, at the bottom of the our page, which allows you access uh, older version and of ensemble. Uh, on the home page, you can also find information about of the species uh, represented in the ensemble. Uh, there are quick links uh, to our most popular species, uh, the human and mouse and zebrafish as well as the links to view the full list of the ensemble uh, species. Uh, here you can uh, also navigate to press sites um, where you can browse new genomic ensemble uh, that are not yet fully annotated uh, and the uh, ensemble genome uh, website. We could search directly from this main page by typing um, box into the search bar however let's click on the homo sapiens and to move to species specific home page and uh, for uh, human click on the links to the four um, different gene assemble uh, her we find information about annotated data uh, for this particular uh, species for example, uh, GRCH38, uh, uh, you can see that. Click on the more information and statistical and give the extra information uh, about uh, this uh, gene references uh, region. For example, gene annotation and different uh, genome information. And uh, also you can uh, find about the gene annotation methodology, the comparative genomic analysis, variation data and regulation data. And also you can find out about uh, gene uh, ensemble uh, itself by clicking on the more information and statistical uh, analysis and different uh, information. You can jump to browser uh, dedicated uh, to the uh, this gene uh, region. Maybe, uh, for example, you can click on the uh, this type, and you can uh, receive any information, all details. Now uh, we will search uh, for a gene uh, of interesting by typing. Uh, for example, I can use uh, box gene in the search bar at the top of the uh, page and click on the go and click on this first thing go to the gene summer page uh, for box genes the ensemble uh, gene identifier for this uh, gene is in specific uh, code and this is this, um, this the stable uh, identifier meaning that even if this gene is updated, the ID should remain the same from one ensemble release to the next. Uh, other stable IDs the in ensemble include uh, an ENCT uh, for transcript uh, variation. Okay, uh, this page uh, gives the different uh, information about uh, box genes, and the ensemble wheels uh, are separated into tabs. Um, at the moment, uh, we are in the gene tab. Uh, links to on the left show specific uh, information for uh, box gene, for example, uh, genome sequencing and uh, genomic alignment, and uh, etc. 
and um, maybe you can uh, see that box chain tree and homology uh, relation uh, relationship and gene ontologies and relation data and box gene expression and from this just summary page we can see that uh, transcripts uh, have been annotated you can also other detailed information you can see that uh, early uh, videos uh, in CBI data and also to see more information about uh, this uh, transcript uh, we can click on the show transcript uh, table uh, other other transcripts are member of the this gene set uh, consequences set of the coding sequencing uh, established as a collaborative uh, effort um, between to ensemble um, project. Further down this page, we can see that transcript uh, model, uh, the counting representing the genomic sequencing uh, is displayed as a show blue bar and transcripts uh, about the counting are on the forward strand and also transcript below the counting are on the reverse strand and boxes represent exons and line containing uh, those boxes are the introns. Boxes are filled uh, in if they contain coding sequencing, especially uh, unfilled boxes represent unstrangulated uh, region. Protein coding transcripts of the uh, box gene show coding sequencing and are on the forward strand of genome. Uh, above the um, blue bar, the colors of the transcript donate the transcript biotype. And one is the colored uh, re this uh, region, uh, which donates uh, that this transcript was annotated by the ensemble automated annotation pipeline as well as the manual annotation by Havana uh, projects. And the other project, other protein coding transcript uh, uh, colored different. Uh, colors uh, was annotated by the ensemble uh, automated uh, annotation pipeline and the blue transcripts uh, for example sometimes a uh, non-coding proceed transcript let's choose one of these transcripts to explore uh, further uh, use this link yes you can see that all of the detailed information uh, this page at uh, and the left uh, bar and there are the links to supporting uh, evidence and further uh, information and to see a uh, sequencing uh, variation on the which uh, this transcript was based uh, as well as the exon uh, cdna and a protein sequence uh, displays uh, other link includes uh, general general uh, identifiers uh, which is where you can see matches the ensemble gene or protein sequencing in order ex external uh, databases such as uh, in port uh, you can uh, even find different protein domains mapped uh, to the amino acid sequence uh, in the protein uh, summary uh, history uh, we and oligo uh, prop mapping uh, in the oligo props uh, webs let's now look at the larger region of the genome surrounding the box gene and click on the location uh, tab in the blue bar at the top of the the region in the tail page. At the top of this page uh, is chromosomal uh, overview and maybe you can see a red box and depict the region of the chromosome and that the sequencing views uh, on this page uh, focus on uh, especially. And uh, scrolling down uh, we are able to see the third most of the detailed depiction uh, of the box genes genomic uh, location and uh, the data is displayed in, in individual uh, tracks and uh, which can be formed moved aid or removed by uh, default uh, we are viewing a small number of tracks including the genes and tracks and mm, the counting track representing the genome uh, ensemble you can add more tracks uh, to the this view by click on the uh, configure uh, the page options 
Uh, active tracks are shown uh, here. You can find uh, additional uh, data uh, tracks aid by searching the sub manuals uh, on the left hand side of the by using the search option uh, in the top left hand corner. Let's choose to see variation uh, from double strand snip uh, data set and uh, click on the variation in the subheadings. Turn on the double stand variation trick uh, by clicking the box and selecting the uh, normal uh, format. Uh, let's also add import alignment and search for import uh, in the search box at the top of the left hand corner. Let's also add import uh, alignment this uh, type and search uh, for an import in the search box uh, at the top left hand corner. For example, uh, for these genes, uh, don't have any uh, correct and don't in any normal format. So, so I, I close the uh, page. Uh, maybe you can uh, search uh, different uh, gene codes and uh, you can uh, find a different uh, track for uh, in Newport. Uh, um, but just now I try to uh, box gene, but uh, don't uh, any information on this about. And maybe uh, show different uh, information uh, this code. Uh, ensemble uh, include different information. Maybe you can try to solve uh, different uh, problems and maybe we can you can uh, focus on this uh, information and find uh, to your research maybe uh, finally we can talk about uh, and help uh, for example you can click on and help is available uh, on most ensemble page and you can uh, access a uh, page uh, specific help by click on the help icons uh, for more uh, information uh, in the help window we find a link uh, to the documentation and there are also links uh, faqs and the videos tutorials and uh, the glossary and thank you uh, for watching this um, brief uh, introduction to Ensemble and maybe you can uh, focus on deeply uh, the website and uh, try to find uh, different example and if you have uh, any question uh, related to Ensemble and different uh, issues uh, please uh, email uh, to me or you can write uh, the bottom of the uh, videos thank you again